I'm going to flip the mood just totally on its head and read something I think is on the same topic, um, but it's a really short poem. I got invited to perform at a Catholic university, and um, when I got the invitation uh, to perform there, there was a clause on the contract that said, um, Andrea will agree to say nothing during the performance that disagrees with the beliefs of the Catholic Church. <laughs> and uh, so Lauren, I'm going to read this one minute poem and then I'm going to bring you up right after because you disagree with me, you know, you're good at this too. Um, anyway, and so I said, I don't know how that's possible if, I, you know, if I'm going to come and read my own poems. And they, they told me that they had been watching my uh, videos on YouTube and they hadn't heard me say one thing that disagreed with the beliefs of the Catholic Church. So I said, great, I will come. And um, I read this poem. It's, it's short. Every month. When I get my period, I breathe a sigh of relief and thank God I'm not pregnant. Because you never know when Jesus is coming back and you never know who God's going to choose to be the next Virgin Mary. And can you imagine anything more scary than staring down between your legs and seeing the little glowing head of baby Jesus? Holy shit, no thank you. You know what kind of bumper sticker would you get? Your son's an honest student? Yeah, well my son walks on water and heals lepers, fuckers. Think of the pressure. Personally? I prefer to give birth to Lucifer, a fixer-upper, the kind of kid that would sit at the Last Supper and complain that Judas got more mashed potatoes, because God knows the holy have done more damage to this world than the devil ever could. Yeah.